You! You, the Nuka World waste pile that thought you could move your gang into sinner's territory and live? You give me one good reason. I shouldn't slice you open and eat your heart right here. You listen closely. This land is ours. So turn around and crawl back under whatever rock you came from. Right now. You talk to me like that? Kill him! <laughs> <laughs> Handled that like a pro, boss. Heard some rumbles, this one didn't get you either. Figure I shouldn't be surprised. Oh no, Shank. I died. I'm a ghost. <laughs> well, your secret's safe with me, regardless. So I suppose your recent success brings us to the next step. Loyalty. Without loyalty, everything that's yours ain't. And to keep a crew loyal, you need to keep them happy. Now, keeping raiders happy isn't real hard. Just have to make sure they've got their basic necessities. Just like any other settlement. That they've got some things to keep them entertained. And that their food's taken care of. Which, with raiders, well, isn't like dealing with other settlements. Now, if you want me to go into detail on any of that, you just say. What can you tell me about entertainment for the outpost? Well, it's a damn handy way to keep folks distracted if you're lacking in certain basics. Constructing pick-me-up stations or getting one of your crew working on a booze still will certainly help lift your outpost's <laughs> spirits. And if the place has got a Nuka World transmitter powered up, you can construct amplifiers to help as well. Anything else I can answer for you? I want to know more about managing the outpost's basic necessities. Day-to-day -day needs. They're pretty straightforward. Just need to make sure you've set up solid defenses. Plenty of beds under cover, and enough clean water to go around. Not much more to it than that. Was there anything else? Tell me more about providing food for the outpost. So, managing your outpost's food can get a little tricky. No one ever joined a crew to dig in the dirt. So you'll want to make sure you've convinced enough settlements to supply your gang. People at the outpost can farm in a pinch, but they sure as hell won't be happy about it. Now, if you're ever wondering if your outpost has enough food, you should take a look in your Pip-Boy. It ought to have a page that'll show you everything your outpost currently needs, food included. If they're low on grub, it's probably time to get a new settlement supplying you. Or you could always drop some food direct in their workshop if it comes to it. Now, was there something else? I think I've got everything I need to know. Sure. If you've ever got more questions, you come find me. Or you can always consult that pit boy on your arm. 
No better tool to tell you what your outpost may be hurting for. Now, this time around, seems the outpost doesn't need much setting up. Means we can start looking onward. And with the place in as good shape as it is, I was thinking it might be time I set up shop there. Save you a trip any time you want to run a job. You just let me know if that's something that'd interest you. Be good to make some trouble in the Commonwealth again. So, you ready for the final piece of the puzzle? And that is... Bodies. And not the kind the disciples like to leave sitting around. Because what you've made is a foothold. To solidify our place, our outfit's gonna need some real numbers. Two more outposts carved from the Commonwealth ought to do the trick. Get all that together, and, <laughs> well, we'll have a real base of power on our hands. With that kind of clout, we'll be able to start setting up dealers at our outposts, get to selling stuff like real damn towns. We keep expanding from there, we'll even be able to set up spots where the locals can come drop off tribute. But I'm getting ahead of myself. For now, You'll want to start by claiming another two outposts. You just let me know whenever you want to get rolling on those jobs. So, boss, what's the plan? I want you to head to an outpost. Yeah, sure. Where am I going? Suppose I better get a move on then. See you there, boss.
Hey, Shank. Hey there, boss. You looking for me to set up a couple jobs so we can start claiming those two outposts? Or did you need something else? I'm interested in running a job. You got it. Just need the details. What job you looking to run? A new outpost. I want to get one set up. Got it. So how'd you want to approach it? Talk them into leaving yourself, or you and the crew putting some lead in them? I'll convince them to leave. Yeah, sure. And which crew should I have join you once you've staked your claim? The Disciples. Can do. So, what's the target? Mm-hmm. Oh, that place. Isn't that one of your old stomping grounds? Sure that's the one? That one's the target. <laughs> Ruthless. So, standard runoff job. You can scare the hell out of them, or try to buy them off. Whatever you need to do to get them off their land. Claiming additional outposts within range of the target will also help make convincing them go better. But that's more big picture. Something to consider as you plan out future conquests. Happy hunting, boss. Something I can do for you? There's a gang of raiders coming for this place. Mine. But if you leave right now, I promise you, we won't have any problems. You want this place? Listen, not trying to piss you off here, but I I'm not sure that's gonna work. This is home. <sighs> Look, I'm trying to help you here. You need to go. Now, look, why don't you just do us both a favor and scram? Out here, you gotta take things one day at a time. Lost track of how many blisters. Hey, I got. you. Yeah? Was there something else you needed? Now, I'm gonna make this easy for you. 
Take these caps and go. Caps? For this? Uh, yeah, fine. I, I guess it's all yours. Not gonna bother you, all right?
Shank. Hey, boss. Just one more outpost to claim. You want me to set up that job, you just say. So, what do you need? I was hoping you could arrange a job for me. Yeah, yeah. What kind of job we talking here? I want to convince a new settlement to start coughing up supplies. Ought to take care of those new outposts first, boss. Then we can talk supplies. Now, if there's something I can set up for you, you just let me know. It's time we took over another settlement. And did you want to talk the settlers off their land yourself? Or should I rally some bodies to help you put them on ice? I'll run them off their land myself. Got it. And which crew should I have join you once you've staked your claim? The pack. I'll send word along. Or howl or something. So, where do you want to hit? Mm-hmm. Oh, that place. Isn't that one of your old stomping grounds? Sure that's the one? Actually, I changed my mind. You got it. So, you want to name a different target? Or a different job, maybe? Let's try another target. Just need the details. So, where you want to do this? Mm-hmm. Huh. I think that one's your territory, boss. You're sure that's the one you want to hit? Actually, I changed my mind. Sure. You want to name a different target? Or a different job, maybe? Let's try another target. Sure thing. So, where do you want to hit? Mm hmm. Huh. I think that one's your territory, boss. You're sure that's the one you want to hit? That one's the target. Of course, boss. So, standard runoff job. You can scare the hell out of them, or try to buy them off. Whatever you need to do to get them off their land. Claiming additional outposts, something to consider as you plan out future conquests. But ultimately, it's up to you, boss. Good luck. <laughs>